Okay, so um, I kind of split um, of summarizing the lesson into three parts, kind of talking about the different chapters. So in Numbers 30 through 31, um, the principle is that Moses teaches the how to make or break a vow or covenant and in how we can express gratitude um, for these vows. Um, and to develop our understanding of this principle, we have this question on the board that um, you don't have to answer, um, but right now. Um, but just kind of really thinking in your mind of, um, of this question and ponder on it <laughs> um, to develop a better understanding. Um, okay, so in the scriptures, um, well, in the story of the uh, Midianites, is that how you say it? Midianites, yeah. Midianites uh, were slain by the Israelites because um, they needed uh, the land, and so they were talking to Moses about how they would um, do it, but the Midianites weren't a wholesome people, and they weren't um, expressing gratitude, um, and didn't make these vows, so he was like, I guess, like, you can take their land and stuff. Um, and to apply this principle is to stay holy and obey the rules that come with the ordinances. So you don't get slain. Um, okay, in Numbers 32, do you want to do So, the Lord commands his people to be holy. No, no, no. That's, that's not us. Okay. No. <laughs> so, um, he guides them to do the work's help, to do the Lord's help, Lord's work. <laughs> he helps them. Um, Tribes of Israel want to enter into promised land, ask for forgiveness so that they could cross. <laughs> They're not full sentences. Oh. <laughs> okay. Um, so that they help others and ask God for guidance. And we, we can ask and receive guidance to support others and ourselves. And then, oh gosh. Um, Oh, also, for that, um, kind of a thing to think about is the Lord holds us holds us responsible to help others uh, to receive um, the, our blessings. Um, you might have heard the like saying, um, I'm forgetting it, it's like, you do unto those, let's see, you do unto me, I don't know, but you know what I'm talking about. Um, the golden rule. Yeah. yeah. Um, and, and it's true, and also if we help others obtain the Lord's blessings, then we are also as blessed well. So if we help others get blessings and make sure that they are keeping their ordinances and obeying and, and guiding people as well, then we will also receive blessings. Um, and in Moses 33 through 36, Moses reviews um, Israel's journeys and instructs them concerning um, the land inheritance and cities of refuge. Um, and you guys can act on um, any promptings uh, that you receive as they study the scriptures. So that's Numbers 32 through 36. And this is our quote. Oh, um, yeah. This is our quote. It says, And now, my dearly beloved brethren and sisters, let me assure you that these principles are, that these are principles in relation to the dead and the living that cannot be lightly passed over as pertaining to our salvation. For their salvation is necessary and essential to our salvation. As Paul says concerning the fathers, that they without us cannot be made perfect. Neither can we without our death be made perfect. And hope you took something from this. Let me say these things in Jesus Christ, amen.